What is a reflective essay? A reflective essay is a writing genre that requires you to reflect on a personal experience or situation using self-reflection that allows you to grow and develop. Just like other essay genres have a particular purpose, the reflective essay seeks to critically analyze one's experiences and is similar to a journal entry. As such, readers are allowed to use the first-person perspective pronoun I since it is a bit more casual. Writing a good reflective essay is relatively easy, but there are integral elements that affect its quality, such as the structure and word choice. When writing a reflective essay, one is not only tasked to write in the first-person perspective, but it is also less formal. However, one needs to maintain objectivity when addressing your reasoning in the moment and its implications with regard to the theory it relates to. Additionally, theories provide explanations for real-life events and human behavior. What are the different types of reflective essays? Over the course of your education, you are likely to have come across different types of essays. They are considered separate categories since they seek to fulfill different purposes. For example, an argumentative essay seeks to present a viewpoint on a topic and persuade readers to accept it, while a descriptive essay describes an object or individual in a way that forms a vivid picture in the reader's mind. The purpose of a reflective essay is to reflect on the experience, identify new information, plan how to improve the experience or the results, and connect real life to theory. All these different purposes are fulfilled under the following categories. 1. Reflective report. This is the simplest type of reflective essay to handle as it does not follow a rigid structure or require technical details. Rather, you may tell a personal story that describes an experience and examines it. Alternatively, you may choose to focus on a particular theme or use a chronological method to present the facts, too. Critical incident analysis, commonly used for professional practitioner reports, particularly in the health sector, a critical incident analysis requires you to analyze an event in your professional life. You are required to analyze the various challenges you faced and the reasons they occurred and evaluate the decisions you made, in addition to what you learned that could be applied in similar incidences in your career. 3. Case study. Sometimes, you may draw a case study from your own personal experience and attribute it to a particular theory or phenomenon that explains your actions. It can be used to gauge your understanding of the theory and your own observational skills. You may also show how a theory predicts or explains events. 4. Journal entries. Unlike a reflective report, writing reflective journal entries is an ongoing process where one reflects on a learning process or their life in general and helps students develop better habits and learn more effectively. How to write a reflective writing essay. Essays have a particular structure that allows you to present your thoughts logically with regard to the content required by the essay genre. However, most essays follow the standard introduction body conclusion essay format with slight changes in content for each genre to accommodate the differences. For example, an argumentative essay requires you to introduce your thesis statement in the introduction, while a narrative essay requires you to introduce your setting and characters. The reflective essay structure you should follow differs slightly due to the content, hence looks something like this. 1. Reflective essay introduction, considered one of the most important sections of an essay. The introduction can attract or repel readers. As such, our reflective essay writing help experts advise you to use a hook such as a surprising fact, background information, a question, or an anecdote. Literary techniques such as vivid imagery, humor, and suspense can also help draw readers in. This help forms an engaging introduction to your essay. You should also use a thesis statement that summarizes the point of your essay in a thesis statement, too. Reflective essay body. This section of the reflective essay requires the most thought since it is common for students to repeat themselves or skip over important details leading to plot holes. Writing experts would advise you to write a draft in chronological order to also ensure coherence. Also, include points of reflection where you analyze your actions and try to attribute them to the thesis statement and a particular theory. This can also help reveal your personality and how you cope with various life experiences. While this seems easy enough on text, it can be hard to implement, so you may hire reflective essay writing help from our experts and request a quote today. 3. Reflective Essay Conclusion In your conclusion, offer a summary of the events and lessons learned. 
You may also note how your behavior or thinking has changed after reflecting on it. Did the experience improve your problem-solving or observational skills? How would you handle this situation in the future? Five tips for the best reflective essay. Following a reflective essay structure is not enough. Your writing also needs to be top-notch, which can be achieved by implementing the following tips meant to improve your reflective essay. 1. Have a rough draft. Focusing too much on perfection on the first try can lead to time wastage. For this reason, our reflective essay writing help service experts would advise you to avoid overthinking the essay and just start writing whatever comes to mind with a technique known as free writing. While it may not be your best, it allows for your ideas to flow freely, thus forming a good draft too. Form an outline once you have an idea of the theme of your reflective essay. Form an outline of the events that occurred in chronological order and the theories that can help explain the events. This step ensures that you do not include irrelevant content or skip information leading to plot holes. 3. Choose your words carefully. Words have an impact, hence it is important to choose those that convey the specific meaning you are trying to communicate to readers. This can be done by growing your vocabulary to include more sensory words and understanding various synonyms. For example, you may use illustration in place of case, frosty in place of cold, and fiery to replace hot, among others. 4. Be transparent. Part of proper reflection is being honest with your thoughts and feelings. As such, you should be willing to express your honest feelings as you experience them at the moment. It also helps you write a good story that draws readers in. 5. Use good sources. Reflective essays require you to relate your experience with a theory. As such, you will need a reputable source that proves the theory's relation to your experience. This proves your analytical and observational skills.